Hello guys, welcome to another vlog. Oh, today's video is sponsored by Nominal. I love their jewelry. I used to already know I'm always wearing their rings and wearing their necklaces. I think if there is like one brand I never take off is Nominal because like they have such stackable necklaces. Like look at these. You can, those two, I literally wear them with everything else I wear. Like I can wear them with another Nominal pendant or I can wear them with any other necklace I already own. So it is really the perfect brand to stack. So yeah, go check them out. I'm gonna put the links of my necklaces in the bio. So yeah, and tell me what you think and if you already have nominal pieces. Today we are going gate shopping. The weather is not very ideal, but we're still gonna go gate shopping. We're going to go to the express bus terminal. It's like, one of the hugest places to go shopping like as in there's so many shops so many stores so we're gonna go there i uh, will see you there another outfit that is very usable for me and that's my bus turns out i took the bus a long way so i'm gonna get out and get a cab because i have too much of a migraine to do this in a bus So we arrived to destination. Um, it is, it's actually a Shinsegi, Shinsegi mall. I didn't know that, but yeah, I think that, that it is here. Um, but I don't think it's like the actual mall. It's like the underground that is like really full and everything. But you don't really see. We're going to see how it is. Oh, looks nice. Let me show you. Looks really nice. Let me show you. So I have no idea where I'm going because I didn't really I don't really know where it is, like where the main area with the, all the shops are. So I'm just going to explore, as always, exploration. And when I see like an H&M or a mango, I will stop because that's where I wanted to look at stuff. Okay, so for my own outfit today, there is an outfit that I would totally wear for Eid. We have a villa scarf, hijab, and it is white and it is in jersey. It is one of their new collections. I love it and I wear it all the time. We have a naked shirt. I don't think it exists on this website anymore, but like there's a lot of alternatives. I have um, suit trousers and uh, Charles and Keith bag it is one of my new favorites and of course we have the nominal jewelry that i just can't like just can't like go off so yeah this is an outfit that i would totally refrain and now we're gonna try three outfits from h&m that i liked and yeah i'll show you guys 
So, first we have this white dress. It is a very beautiful dress. It doesn't have a belt. It goes all the way to your feet. It's very transparent, so I didn't take off my pants. But this is how it looks like. It is transparent everywhere, so you would have to wear something underneath. It's very hijabi. But I really like it. I love the material. It's very like flowy and everything. And I think it's a very like nice outfit for Eid. Because, you know, like there's... It feels... It just feels fresh. And I feel like with a nice hijab, nice makeup, nice shoes, it can be like a very, very nice outfit. Great, great outfit. Let's move on to the next outfit. Okay, I don't know what to think about this one. It's like, it's like nice, but it looks like a gelabie. I don't really I really don't know what to think about it. Like it's nice. I feel like with a belt it could be even nicer. But I don't really like the length and since I'm tall it's like it looks like it's just short, like small on me. It doesn't look like it's cut this way. So I don't really like the length, but for like petite I would I think it's pretty. With a nice belt it can look really nice. Yeah, it's really Dommage that it's too short and there's like big slits on the sides. So you would have to wear something underneath mm, But yeah, I would rate this one like 4 out of 10 and Yeah, let's move on to the last outfit from H&M So this is the last outfit. I think it's my favorite outfit from the three um, It's like a top that I think they consider a dress but I wear it as a top with trousers that are the that have the same print. I really love the print. It's a really pretty print. It's like pistachio color print, and I really love this color. So I would pair it with this hijab, and I really love it. I I love everything about it. But I'm going to show you another way to wear it, cause like maybe you don't like this style on top. So I'm going to show you how I would wear it with the shirt that I am initially wearing because it will look just as good. So this is the alternative. I just put my shirt on and I put one of the slits inside. It's really pretty. I really like, I think I prefer it this way than with the whole like green outfit because I don't really like, I don't really like the fit on me of the dress but it is very pretty and it can look very pretty on like girls who are into that because i don't see myself wearing it because i don't wear that thing these things a lot but this is how i would style it with a shirt like this maybe not black socks but yes and with a white hijab like this and yeah so these are the outfits that I thought would look good for Aid from H&M. Um, tell me what you think about them in the comments. Now I'm gonna go and look in other stores. Like, I don't know if I'm gonna find a store that is kind of available everywhere in the world. So I try something on that I like for Aid. And yeah, I will show you. Peace. Okay, so I know I'm fasting, but I really crave this patisserie and it looks so good. So I'm gonna take something for like dessert later this night. Uh, uh, to go. To go. Yes. Yay! I got my patisserie. I took a, like an almond croissant and um, what is it called? <gasps> and a pain suisse it's like really french i hope it tastes like it but yeah it's really good okay so uh the gps is telling me that is this way 
like that mango is this way like it's not in the um, in this mall I don't know where else it can be but we are about to see so I have to just walk for like nine minutes and I'm supposed to get there so we'll see so there are lots of shops and restaurants here so I suppose I just suppose it's supposed to be at the end of this like on end of this line so yeah I'm gonna go there oh and there's Daiso I want to go to Daiso there's some things that I want to take so I'm gonna go there too before you start so it is telling me that I arrived but I don't see it and I feel like I'm in literally in the middle of nowhere like I'm not supposed to be here and I can't find my shop my store so I don't know what to do I guess there won't be a mango in this vlog but I hope what I did was enough because I cannot find it huh. I really cannot find it and I'm so hungry and I'm so thirsty but it's just not in here uh, yeah I think I'm just gonna go to Daiso then go to the restaurant and and meet with one of my follower friends from Instagram and eat with her yeah this sounds more like a plan because I really cannot find mango I'm so sorry <laughs> I feel so silly because I really looked it up and I found one here like I found a mango here but it's not here it's not here anymore I don't know but there's no mango so yeah I'm sorry and <laughs> I really feel so stupid <laughs> oops to make it up to you I will link up like a few dresses that I already saw on the website and that I really liked and I really think they would look good for Aid and yeah you can just see if you like them and if you do you can get them for yourself and yeah we're going to Daiso now oh my god this is a good lighting I, I've been having very very bad lighting since the beginning of this video okay it is bad now Okay, I'm so tired. Okay, I'm gonna show you the paradise that is Daiso. Bro, this place is my paradise. I really love coming to Daiso. It is crazy how much I love coming there. Like coming here. Like, look at all this. It's so beautiful. They have so many cute, nice things that don't even cost anything. Like, a whole, a whole thing like this, it costs 3,001, which is like 2 euros. It's crazy. I love this. I wish they had this in France. And they literally have everything from like house things to literal like trash cans like detergents jars uh, garden stuff kitchen stuff everything they really have everything i'm literally getting things that are so random but i want them to make food because i want to make things at home and yeah i know my glasses are not put correctly but who cares? Not me. This is very much better. Now I can move better. Let's go. They really be selling the cutest things ever. Like everything is so cute. They have like bags for gifts. They have pillows. They have <gasps> avocados. He's so cute. Sorry, I'm just... <gasps> it's so cute! 
I'll, I'm gonna have a family of avocados at home. Yeah, so I was saying they really have everything. They even have candles that smell so good and that are so not expensive. They make me think about like the IKEA candles, you know? Yeah, even like the smell, everything looks like it. I think I'm gonna take one of these. I love the smell. So right now I'm looking for like the decoration section because I want to decorate for it like the house but I cannot manage to find it like right now I'm, I'm at the like the whole like candy and uh, snack section but I want to go to the decoration section but yeah I'm gonna pick up some snacks to put them like for it and I'll see so I'm getting Haribo they have like halal Haribo and I'm getting milk caramel because Sarah loves milk caramel so I'm getting these and I think for now that's it I'm also gonna get these because they're so good I don't know oh they like the sun too and yeah for now that's it I found the section so I think I'm going to get one of those look cute maybe um oh i will get balloons i already got those balloons they look cute so those they look cute and yeah well i don't think they have anything else that would look nice but um i think we're pretty good already oh i want to get these Uh -huh. Wait, there's there's so many. I'm gonna get one of these. So nice. Okay, this is way too full, but it's okay. Let's go. Oh my god, they have those. <gasps> I, I learned how to do it and I used to do it when I was in like middle school when I was in, in Saudi I used to do this oh my god it was so nice I miss it I used to know how to do with this and with this oh I literally want to get some like I, I want to get one I, th I think I used to have this one like this is too thick I had ones like this oh I miss it Oh, this is small? So I just finished with today, so I have this huge bag that I'm going to take around with me to Iftar and now I'm going to take a cab again to go to Iftar because it's in like 15 minutes and I need to get to eat one ASAP to meet with a friend so yeah let's go and I'll show you my food later I just grabbed water because I'm sure I'm gonna have to drink in the cab and I'm so thirsty so I'm not waiting to get to the restaurant to drink but yeah uh, my cab is here so I'm gonna get it and I'm um, leaving. Yeah. I don't I'm not making any sense today. I hope you understood anything I said in this vlog. So I'm going to that restaurant there. But I can't find the entrance. <laughs> I've literally never been this kind of lost. Like, I really just cannot manage to know how to enter. I don't know. I don't know. Food. Uh, look at that. Wow. So, I am back home. 
and um the food was really good i just wanted to enjoy the moment and just relax so i didn't really film what happened but the food was really good and it was like a jordanian jordan jordanian jordanian <laughs> it was a restaurant specialized in jordan jordan okay i'm sorry i don't know how to say it but uh, and uh, it was really good i ate um manzi and msakhan um, and tabbouli and like baba ghanou jilabni and hummus sabaha and it was really good i would rate this restaurant like 8 out of 10 8 and a half out of 10 it was really good and i met a nice cute girl she was really nice and um yeah that was it for today so i bought so many things from daiso so this little guy has a little brother now Ta-da! <laughs> i love avocado so much it's crazy but yeah we're gonna give him a name okay guys how do i call him tell me in the comments how should i call him other than that um i hope you liked today's vlog it was kind of messy i'm so sorry it just didn't go as planned but i still want to show you guys what i did today and hopefully next time i will do better um so yeah bear with me while i'm still learning and uh yeah i'll see you guys in the next video